Hey, orange one here. So we have an infection. We gotta deal with that. <laughs> Luckily for us, we have electronics, so we should be able to make a lighter. Um, and these things, not a proper lighter, but uh, an electric one. So there's like an electric fire starter. We're gonna need that. And we're gonna need that soon. So what we're gonna do is, cause I am not feeling super good about our chances of finding disinfectant, is we're just gonna smash something that will give us some scrap metal and some wire. And we're gonna we're gonna make that work. So if I look here, there's a lot of glass, but not really much useful stuff. Is there anything that would give me some wire maybe? And there's a broken console that might do. Let's have a let's have a little look see. Um Hold on. I hurt my hands. Ow. Um, maybe I should try getting that umbrella or something, or wielding. I don't know. Or can I disassemble? Can I actually properly disassemble? No, I can't. I thought. Can I wield umbrella? Or the chunk, chunk of steel, maybe? Yeah, let's get the chunk of steel. Smash that. And then that, I think, the plank is actually a better bashing weapon. So let's get the plank. Yeah. And then I hit... Actually, sorry, let's just wait a little bit. Like that. The broken console, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. Oh, man. Really? Okay, um... At the very least, oh, no, this isn't gonna work. Okay, um, what is this right here? And a railing? We can't smash that, no. Okay, we're gonna have to get maybe wires from. We're gonna have to get it from something, but it's it's not so as bad as I thought. Oh, was there? Oh yeah, there's the blob there. Have a look at what we just got there. We got some copper wire. That's kind of what I'm going for. Magnesium dioxide. Okay. Good for you. Um, sorry about the heart rate. Let's just wait a minute. Okay. Um, what do we need for the fire? Okay, so 30 of those? No, that's not going to happen. We need proper wire for that then. What have we got here? Anything that would give me wire? No. bad situation. Definitely a bad situation. Let's just keep on... Um, maybe I shouldn't be doing that. Maybe they'll drop something useful though. That is possible. A hacksaw. Potassium hydroxide? Uh, yeah. Uh... Let's just have a look, see what they drop. Zinc powder, that's not something that you can use to clean with, is it? These things, they just don't tell you. I mean, I think that you could pour these things on a wound and it would just be absolutely terrible for you. <laughs> be bad for the whatever's infecting it. But it would clean things. Okay, now that we've taken those guys out, maybe I should see what's beyond. Yeah, there's another scientist there. Um, some mutant limbs. What do you have for me? Not that good of stuff. Dang. 
oxidizing powder. No, that's not what we need. Come on. What have we got here? A library? Oh man. Let's not mess with that. I said I wasn't even gonna mess with those. We'll just go back down and... Oh, that's another library. Oh, interesting. Okay, come on. RNG, you really are not feeling this right now. What is that? A centrifuge? What does that drop? Copper wire. Actually, a decent number of it, too. Yes. Okay, so we've got some copper wire. We can work with this. Yeah. Okay, we can totally work with this. getting all the copper wire. I think I, I have 30 now, right? Yeah, I've got 30. Chunk of steel, I think that's all I needed. Alright, um... Oh, scrap metal. That's what I need. We do have to deal with this, though. Uh, scrap metal, sure. We're gonna have to get out of this lab soon, but we have to deal with this um, infection. Fine. Ignore. Uh, fire starter. Reload. And hold on. Can I cauterize? How do I do this again? Uh, cauterize wound. Oh wait, uh, yeah. Ah oh, man. Okay. Well, it it worked. Yay. We are no longer infected good times. Man, speaking of this, oh my gosh, like, that is not fun. Having, like, one of those gnarly infections. I don't know if you've, as an adult, if you've had, had to deal with that. <laughs> but, like, yeah, make sure you disinfect things well. <laughs> Let's just say that. <laughs> not a fun thing. Um, yeah, I'll keep that in my inventory. Honestly, now that we are not infected, I'm feeling a lot better about our chances of getting out of here. I'm really glad that us trying to open that library didn't end the run. I don't know why I did that. I'm actually gonna smash these corpses as well. I don't want them getting them back up. I think that we might regret doing that, but I also don't really think that's the case. I could also see about what I could do crafting-wise um, to get some other tools that might be of use. Um, I really would like a flashlight. What, what do I need for a flashlight again? Amplifier circuits, light bulbs, yeah. Right, it was the light bulb, that was what it was. Of course, I'm not going to be able to craft a bulb, I don't know why I was even checking that. Was that fire extinguisher, though, that I had been looking at? I really wish that we could disassemble those, but we can't. Um, so where were we? Where was I going? There was these guys that I had fought and killed, and they dropped a ton of stuff, which we should probably be checking out. And maybe even equipping some more of this. These gloves, I kind of feel like I should have on. Yeah, well, we're gonna... Oh, there's a headlamp. Oh, we're definitely gonna equip that. Um, because then that we can turn on. I'm pretty sure. Isn't that a headlamp with, like, a, a light on it? Let's get those on as well. With the sunglasses, that'll help with glare. It'd be nice if we could clean these things, but... <laughs> I'll take what I got. Yeah, we are definitely a little, little encumbered now. We're not infected. So we can think. That's what I love to do. You guys know that. Oh man, have you guys had some good food recently? Like, what did you have for, like, <coughs> holiday break, you know? It's like, I know that a lot of people will have, like, traditional meals or whatever. They do, like, every year they do it. Yeah, I really should be still prioritizing getting out of this lab. 
Oh yeah, we had gone up here and there was like a noise over there or something. And then there was, uh, can I attempt to hack it? No, I don't have enough or any way of doing so. Can I get a glimpse of what we've got? Are we in? Oh, we're under a prison. <gasps> that is, if that is the case, if this is like a prison. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I forgot that we were, that we kind of knew that. So cool. Okay, well, there's a couple enemies that we're going to have to deal with. Um, oh, CBMs. Oh my gosh, I've got CBMs here. And a number of friends, a dissecting microscope. I could probably disassemble that for some good stuff. I really do want to try and disassemble that, I think. It's going to take our character 45 minutes, though. Well, if I wanted to install a CVM, I could do that, though I don't see why I would want to install something that just keeps track of time. Like, literally worthless. Yeah, we're not going to mess with the zombies. We'll leave them behind there. They're not going to get out of there. Okay, this science card has to um, get us out of here then. If that is it, then that actually wasn't too bad to break out of. Doors locked. Whatever. Um, yeah, I maybe want to get an idea of what is nearby. There's something south of me that's hearing me doing that. Okay, interesting. We've got something up here that can kind of hear us. What can I see around here? <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, that sounds um, weird. <laughs> well, we have we have the surface. We can see the surface. It's being simulated. I'm a little bit nervous about trying to unlock that um, with the other zombies hearing us. So what I'm gonna do is see if we can make a lock lock pick. Um, some scrap metal. Oh, what? Ten minutes from two wires. So if I can get wire, I can... I can make some, but I need to find something to make wire out of. What can I make wire out of? There isn't wire inside of these, is there? No, I didn't think so. There might have been, though. You never know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they can see me, they can move around, it's whatever. Okay, well, we have an option to get out. If we need to, we can kick down the door, literally, because we've got, like, the hooves and everything, right? Oh, look, there's... Oh, yeah. Okay, we got wire. We also have some security guards. Okay, well, I do know where my wire is. I just know that I could get infected trying to get it there. So... <laughs> Yeah, I, I was going to start talking about some of the food that we made during break then. Yeah, got a little distracted. Oh, this, this place seems pretty empty. Pretty good source of wire. I'm just also checking to see if it's a good source of our stuff. Yeah, now that we've um, essentially cleared out this place, we probably should actually loot the lab. You know? Oh, there's someone down there apparently. I'm going to go here and try and smash this fence. Yeah, okay, cool. That should be enough for one of them, right? Isn't that what I needed? Yeah, just drop the plank. Oh no, I'm going to have to carry all of them individually. No, that doesn't work. <laughs> um, drop, I guess, the autoclave pouches? 
I don't know. Maybe drop both of those. I don't know what's going on. How how are the wires like huge or something? Volume is 0.5. Yeah, that seems a little bit la large to me. But maybe I'm I'm being unrealistic. But it's like the longest side too, I think. And it's like calculating it kind of weird. I don't know. All I know is that we need to get this wire to the light. And then we'll be able to um, do some things with it. Uh, is that actually, that's actually lit up. <laughs> I'm not going to get attacked on here, am I? No. Okay, cool. Um, can I go like... How do I do this going with the stairs? Or no, you need to haul it, don't you? Yeah, it's hauling. Um, and then I can go here and stop hauling. Yeah, they're here. Hopefully I don't get attacked while I'm trying to make my, my lockpick. Oh, fine bolt turning. Didn't we have pliers or something? There was some, I could have sworn there was pliers that we had found somewhere. I, I know that we did. That's the thing. Pretty sure it's by the um, these guys right here. Yeah, pliers. The everything that you need to escape. You just need to know all the items in the game. Oh, I was going to say, like, um, we I love parsnips. And we made like, oh, this amazing like roasted parsnip and then leek uh, soup thing. So good. I love those two things. Like, I would be a happy man if I could just have that in my life. Sure, ten minutes of that. Let's do it. As long as, unless I'm seeing something that's about to attack me, I think we're okay. Okay, so we got a lockpick. I really should be looking at my crafting. And my armor and and trying to craft some armor from like cloth and other random stuff um do i also have my headlamp on i do can i reload that oh i do not have anything to reload that with okay well at least i got something on my head that protects my head <laughs> let's see if we can get out of here god i love this game it's a good thing we found that science ID card, you know. Oh, we damaged our tool. It is a wood door, so I really could just get out of here pretty easily. Just keep on going till we get it. Yeah, destroyed it. <laughs> That's what I thought. Yeah, what we really need to do is like make a bindle or something. Make shift uh, sling. Is this storage? What is this? This isn't for your arm, is it? Yeah, it is actually. Um, could I not do that? That seems like a really bad thing. A pouch, maybe? No, I don't have anything with sewing. Or pants. If I could find pants, that would work. But of course, we don't have pants. Not here. Oh, I've got some cops here. Nice. Good times. Self preserving protocols activated. Um, I guess we're gonna have to do more. Maybe let's 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 make the bindle thing because it's gonna I think help us carry the wires. Sure. That'll act as like a backpack for us, right? Oh wait, no, 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 that is actually for your arm. Ignore. Just not something that we need. What about that bindle? 
Yeah, we could get that with some rags, actually. Let's just cut up one of these. I could have made one of those in, in there. Oh, I'm in a bad mood. Why am I in such a bad... Oh, filthy gear. Yeah, I should probably take off some of my filthy gear. Let me take that off. That off. Headlamp and motorcycle helmet? That seems a little bit unnecessary. Can you do... No? Okay. It looks like our character's a little salty about things. Why don't you read a little bit about electronics? We'll see what's kind of going on. It could be that things are stuck indoors down there. I'm also wanting to get like a little tick up in our experience. I got one, one percent of the way through. We're also not very smart, so hence not being able to read. <laughs> um, put that up. Really, you just ah, annoying me. I hurt my hands. Can we get our screwdriver out? Yeah, I'm just gonna smash that. Can I? Did I hit that with my feet? No. Okay. Whatever. Uh, we got some rags though to work with. Though people may have heard that. We do have our bindle though. We can equip, and then we can go get more wire. I think. Yeah, I've got enough to carry the wire now around. We can make like some lockpicks in the sun. Not sun. You know. Um, I'm hurting my hands. I thought I had my screwdriver. Did I just break the table with my hooves? Is that what happened? I think that's what happened, and I hurt my feet doing so. Great. Let's, uh, let's get that out. Come on. Really? Gotta pass out trying to open that up. <laughs> you know, Bootsy... I, I like you. You got you got some fight in you. And not to mention the fact that um you're giving me a challenge, limiting my resources, which I need. Um let's go up here. Lockpick. Can I stop favoriting that actually? We might need to um Oh, it only takes two of ten. Well. Whoops. <laughs> I've got a lot of wire here, here that I don't need. Okay. Still not getting it, huh? <laughs> I mean, it's a wooden door. I can just open it, honestly. Do I have my plank? No. Get my plank. Let's just knock the door down. I tried to be a good boy. Okay, we might need to... move quickly to get out of here. Wooden door there. It's making me a little nervous. Can I climb that? I can. Nice. And I can get out. And the prisoners can kind of see me. I'm not very far. Am I? Am I? I'm not lit up, am I? I'm not lit up. I just... Is it in the middle of the night? Clear. It's bright. Oh, there's a prisoner zombie. Is there a way out of here? Is oh, there's wrenches there. Interesting. Got me intrigued. Um. Oh, do I need to turn off my Ursine night vision? Is that what's going on? Uh, hold on. You turn it back on, I guess. It seems to me like I should be able to see further, but I can't. I'm not sure why. Oh, I'm gonna need to jump the fence 
Oh no. They hit me. Okay, where did he come from? Somewhere with furniture, I hope. Okay, yeah, we can definitely jump the fence here. We just need to get something out here. Oh, where did you come from? Oh no, I'm bleeding. You better not make me bleed. Okay, let's see where we done. Okay, killed another one. I just want to make sure I'm not getting myself in a bad situation here. Yeah, I can hear two of them. Is the thing. I don't think I need to fight them. I think I can out maneuver them. They're not like super dangerous. Like that. I can just yeah. Duck and weave a little bit. Oh no, there's another pr prisoner. Oh, there's two of them, really? Okay. Ah. Um not the best. Okay, there's quite a few of them. We're gonna take them into our neck of the woods. And we'll maybe deal with it in a minute. <laughs> Are they gonna come down? Yeah, I think that we're okay. All right, well that was uh, less than ideal, but we have a game plan. I basically need to haul like some furniture up there and out. Or I think that maybe the beds that I was at, I might be able to use those. Ideally though, I don't want to fight like 10 people. So maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Not sure. Maybe I'll just kind of do some exploring of the lab and let those guys wander around a little bit. I'm also thinking about eating mutated limbs just to see what mutations I get. I don't know. We got options though. We got a couple options. Definitely worth um, checking out some stuff though while we're waiting. You know, why wait kind of thing. The other option is that we could do some crafting and see where those guys go on the top. Because now the thing is is that they've um, broken stuff down. I bet they wander around a lot there. Blanket. I mean, that actually probably has like a ton of wires and stuff in it, doesn't it? I bet if you were to cut that up, you'd get some crafting electronic stuff. I just... Cut it up. Oh, it's just rags, really? There's a, definitely electrical in there. There's an electric thing. Oh, there's a lighter. There's a, just a regular lighter. I didn't need to do the electric fire starting. Well, I, who knows if I would have found that in time, you know? That's the thing, is that you have to consider that. Oh, and it's chilly up there, apparently. So my character didn't like that, going up there. <laughs> oh, we're hungry, too. Um... Well, it's a good thing that we got to the surface, because our character is going to start needing to eat soon. Man, so many options. I think we might want to just go unarmed, but for now, maybe we make ourselves like some basic melee weapon or something. Lots and lots of good options for us. A lot of good um, electronic things that we could do here. I'm thinking the noise emitter would be really nice, but we need a uh, soldering iron, which we don't have. Or actually, we could make one, possibly. Nah, we need duct tape. There's no way that we're getting duct tape down here. See, this is the, the battle that you have to do. If you do a two-way radio, you can't, like, use that for a distraction, though you should be able to, you know, like, talk to the zombies through the radio. <laughs> Uh, the radio here... Oh yeah, actually, I could turn on the radio and that could actually work as a distraction. Oh yeah, let's do that. Um, where's my radio? From your position, you're hearing the radio... Oh, it's, it's on. Some giant yellow thing saying it's on. Oh, I can scan. That's funny. 
turn that off. We're going to see what we can do maybe in the next episode with that radio and distracting people, trying to get some furniture out of here. In any case, thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.